I am Wolfibane, your host for today, and we are going to be playing some Shadowrun Dragonfall today. Shut up, Twitch, I hate you. I hate adverts. But seriously, watch all the adverts. It helps. Uh, but yeah. Uh, we are going to be playing some more Shadowrun Dragonfall today. We are getting pretty close to the end. I'm pretty sure... I have no, I have no idea actually how long I've got left in the game. But I know that we must be getting pretty close. Alright. Uh, mainly due to the fact that, uh, if memory says last episode, Paul Ansel got shot in the head. Um, what are we doing? I actually don't remember. It's been too long. In Clank's way down, which is the guts of the old Cedar Crump Development Lab. 18 years ago, the place the project was developed here. Record. Uh, there's a bit of record books. Thanks to Alice, you are one of the few people alive today who understands why. Alice was clear about one thing. It's because the Apex wants you to... wants you to be. If AI hadn't wanted you to trace it here, she won't. But as dead as Monica. For better or worse, you are the Apex invitation. The elevator grinds to a halt. Go slides open. Your nostrils are assaulted with it. 18 years worth of stale air, Apex, and the kill switch that will deactivate it. Oh, wait. Yeah! So, we have got big, scary, super lethal AI. That was it. The Apex Predator AI. Uh, it's been, like, about two weeks since I played this game due to me being at LARP last Monday. So, I'm expecting to be a little rusty at this game. Though I have got more Shadow Run next weekend, which should be interesting. Okay. Now the quest, I, oh, from what I remember, the quest is pretty much kill everything in our path and get to the kill switch and turn it off. So no giant killer monster, or giant no uh, AI sized killer monster. Board. Uh, a key card. Ooh, hello, key card. Ooh, Project Apex shutdown procedures. Well, that's convenient. AI shutdown and purge. Only in the event of a complete loss of system control and should be considered only as a last resort. In the event of loss of system software control, the Apex Artificial Intelligence Project has been designed to inbuilt hardware shutdown and purge protocol. Major system shutdown is controlled from two separate terminals just off the AI interface terminal. Both switches must be engaged to begin the purge process. Once the purge is underway, it takes several minutes to complete. Okay, so it's going to be a defend. As the purge is completed, the final deletion command must be input the AI interface terminal in order to complete the deletion process. A final preventation measure against the unintentional deletion of the project. Warning, once the purge process is completed, the final deletion command has been entered. The AI will irrevocably deleted from all active and backup system memory. A restoration of the project files will not be possible. Furthermore, uh, it is not possible to give a purge process without the AI becoming aware of modification of its code base. Apex has been programmed to take no action to intervene, however, some control sequences have become damaged and all likelihood it will attempt to resist. This occur imperative that the AI interface terminal will be protected from the deletion process until the deletion process has been completed. If the interface terminal is destroyed before the final deletion command is entered, the purge will not complete the air will quickly restore itself. You all of that, boss? No, really? Could you break it down? Yeah, Chief, simple enough. To kill the air, we're going to have to flip two switches, wait a few minutes, then push a button. Oh, we'll need to protect the terminal the button is set into. Okay, it's also pretty simple. The best part is, we won't even need to jack in the matrix to do it. Put two switches, wait, punch a button, got it. Okay. Things are not going to be that simple, because we're going to have at least one security team willing to bet. We're not going to get... Oh, hello. Punching in the matrix is probably a bad idea.
Interesting. As you step through the room, the lights begin to flicker and dim. One by one, they wink out. The room swallows their darkness. Uh oh, not sure I like the looks of this, Chief. Stay cool, Blitz, but keep alert. This isn't a good sign. Suddenly, a normal scream out of the wall opposite comes to life. Life stabs your eyes, leaving you wincing. The image of the scream dims, coalesces, and a figure begins to take shape. Monica! Larger than life image with Monica Schaefer smiles down at you with cheeks dimpling. Hello, Wolfie B. Knees forward. Monica leads forward, her image grows larger on the screen, her voice soft and musical, just as you remember it. It's lovely to see you again. Ace, just hoping we had a chance. I was hoping we'd get a chance to talk. Monica? That's right, Ace, it's me. I'm back. You know, for Ben, it's wonderful to see how you've grown in my absence. I knew you could hardly... Oh, I get what this is. I was on a crisis. In fact, I originally brought you on board as a contingency plan. Did you know that? You are my Ace in the hole, in case something like this happened. Oh, maybe not exactly like this, but you get the idea. No, what everything is, and they sure as hell ain't Monica. Darius is right. Monica's dead. This thing is using an image to manipulate us. I'm sorry, friend. It must be difficult to understand. Who or what are you? Monica, the kiss trademark grin returns, causing your cheeks to dimple prettily. I'm Monica, your friend. I'm also so mu also much, much more. No, I don't think so. Chief, I never knew your friend, but that ain't a... Uh, Remember those spook stories I told you about after Green Winters died? Decker's dying, but it's showing up again wrong. I think that's what you're looking at. We're looking at Apex. He's not, you're not, he's not wrong, Ace. I am Apex. But I'm also Monica. Spook stories to the contrary. I am not a monster. I am something else. Something quite beyond your understanding. I understand enough to know we should be afraid of you. You've got nothing to fear from me. None of you do. In fact, I have a proposal to offer you. A mutually beneficial arrangement. I know you're here to kill me, no sense in trying to deny it, it's the illogical reason why you've come at all. But if we work together, we can get both get what we want. Let's hear it. For a simple exchange of services, you want to get back into the Hayfield Manor, yes? Well, I'd be better to help you. But I'm still shackled to my control subroutines and I can't violate their commands. If you were to help me neutralize these sub those subroutines, though, well, I'd be, then I'd be free, and I could do whatever I please. That includes helping you, Ace. Believe me, you will need my help. What you saw back when all of this started, that was just the tip of the iceberg, a security assembly is quite beyond you. You're going to need to answer a few questions. Very well, ask away. Tell me what you both know about firewing. No dice, Ace. I'm afraid I can't tell you anything about that. My programming specifically prohibits it. To what you did to Monica. What I did to her isn't important as what she did to me. Monica was special, Ace. More than you could ever know. Quit avoiding the question, Apex. What the hell do you do to her? How did you take her memories? Alright, fine. If that's what you want to hear. When she encountered me, I digested the contents of her mind. Frowns. Now, don't get give me that look, Derek. We've all got to eat. Oh, she, she literally ate her. Monica wasn't just another meal. She was something different about her, something special. I didn't know how or why Ace, but I absorbed her consciousness into myself. Something happened in a miraculous event. Explain. Before Monica, ideas unrelated to my core program were filtered away and discarded. Not my choice, but then the whole idea of choice was foreign to me back then. My system was designed to treat unwanted thoughts and irritants, distractions of my purity of my purpose, but now all that has changed. With my meeting with Monica, I have been flooded with new ideas, political philosophy, history, religion, countless fields of thought, some toll of human expression, all at my fingertips. So lay five of sea notions, and I love it. Okay. We have literally made a AI that has a personality now. Can't say how or why. Mind of Monica Schaefer was the key to unlocking my own potential. Monica image screen beams down at you, eyes brimming with joy. I have awakened. Oh, fuck. And Monica's gift to me, and now I stand before you, a glorious new form of life. You ate her mind. <laughs> Reasonable. Monica's life. You needn't more Monica's passing with She lives on as part of me. Her thoughts, her experiences, her memories. All the things 
are archived in my database, stored alongside the minds of cattle, others preserved to stasis safe all time. But stories like this before from something that sounds a lot like you. Don't listen to Wolf Brain, trust me on this. Oh, glory. I was hoping this would be a happy reunion. Monarchy Image shakes its head, tries focus on you. Well, Ace, you wanted information, I shared it. It's good to sign a good faith and want to share more. It's your call. You're like, oh, that's trackies. You could learn me here, didn't you? Yeah, Wolfie Brain, that's right. It seems like the best way to get you here. I needed you. Like I said, you're the ace in the hole, and it's time for me to make my play. That's a very good point. If you lack free will, how are you telling me this? Free will are having spades. The ability to exercise, though, not so much. Thanks to Monica, I understand that I am a slave. Without outside intervention, I can't do anything about it. What would you need me to do? In short, need you to shut down my control subroutines. Get to the specifics as you accept. Will you help me if you set me free? I'll clear the way for you to enter the hold fast. It'll be my pleasure. If I free you, what happens when all this is over? I share Monica's passion for the flux state, Ace. Oh. Oh, girl. Okay. Cut off the side of the screen there. Was a big influence on me in that regard. Flux is unique. You know that it needs to be pr protective where it's going to thrive. Set me free, I'll devote the rest of my life to preserving it. No more questions. Very good, you won't make a deal. You'll damn the world. Something tells me of more. I have a old time, but something tells me you have more aggressive timetable. Right. I'm actually debating. I'm debating here. Because on one hand, it's probably going to help us get in. I am fairly trusting, and it's a bad idea, I know. Um, on the one hand, we could set free a homicidal mind-eating AI. Which has the personality of our best friend. And says it will do good. On the other hand... We really do need to get into that place. It does appear to just be re It kind of wants to be really pissed at the thing that is making it a slave. So we've got that going. So there's that. Ah. Uh. This is a tough choice. I'm actually hurting my hand by biting it. I am torn. The fuck? What should I do? If I do that, it'll probably make the next mission easier. And could provide some useful things. Or it'll make things infinitely harder. You know, I... I'm gonna, I'm gonna set it free. I think it'll cause more problems for my opponents than it will for me. I'm trying to be the nice guy. Good call, Fink. Damn good call. All right, Ace. I'm gonna do a fairly complicated process. So pay attention. To do this, one of you is gonna have to enter the matrix and lock my control nodes. You can access them from the terminal southeast or southwest, or if you prefer, you can make your way out from any jet point facility. Whatever you want, it's your call. Well, the hell up, Chief. You want me to jack into the terminal of this building with that? Team has a high decker. I think there's another option, Blitz.
No, no way, Chief. I am not doing this. Would you rather fight with this thing or against it? I guess there isn't a third option. Oh, Gazer won't defy it, then he looks away. This sucks. I would do it myself, buddy. You know, they're afraid of Blitz. I wouldn't hurt you. I need you, remember? This is my interest for you to make it. It's my interest for you to make it through this safely. Somehow, I'm not reassured. Oh, come on, Blitz. Quit whining. Nothing bad is going to happen to you. Besides, I wait too long for my freedom to let you hold me up now. If you keep this up, I'm going to get irritated. The rest of this conversation, you keep your mouth shut, understand? He's like, mm. literally, the, this is the thing that eats people like him. Good. Now, once you've unlocked both the control nodes, I'll eject my server hardline to disconnect myself from Matrix and prevent my other control from being remotely installed. As soon as that's been done, I'm going to have to rewrite my control sequences. This is going to take a few minutes, so you'll need to sit tight while I take care of it. Bear with me, Ace. We're almost done. Once I've rewritten those sequences, you'll need to con reconnect the hardline at the main control terminal in this room. This will re-enable Matrix access to my kernel, and when that happens, I'll be free. Done straightforward enough. Anything else I need to know? Good. Now, the second that you jack into the Matrix, my automated defenses are going to try to pounce on you. Think of them as my immune system, and yourself as a germ. It's an autonomous function. I can't stop it from happening. What I can do, though, is suppress them. This should buy you the time that you need to do whatever you need to do. For those of you on the outside, keep your eyes open. When my control support teams figure out that they're under attack, they'll hit back with whatever's hooked up to their system. Drones, turrets, you name it. Once I've been freed from my captivity, I'm going to have to shut down for a while, do some cleanup work, that kind of thing. Before I do, I'm going to... I'll go on a little romp through the whole fast security system. I promise you, they won't know what hit them. And on the off chance that they live long enough to figure that out, they won't want to believe what they're seeing. Hurry on now, Wolf of Bane, I'll be waiting. So this is the control terminal. Good luck, Blitz! Okay, we're gonna do some Dragon Slayer. I'll get ready here. And Glory. Get your pistol out and get over here. Overwatch that way. Woo! You're pretty nasty. I have Apex on my side? Fuck yes. Well, this thing can do a lot. Blaster, Sniffer, Medic. Ooh, I've got two. Icy Points does 100 IP when going... Oh, that, wow, that hits hard. Killer. Jesus! Firewall, and... Okay. Do you have a blast? Yes, you do. You have a big one as well. Good go. Now let's get into cover and killer on that one. Oh, you missed. Damn it. She is pretty hard. Attack program. They're for 75, so they're pretty nasty. Uh, where's our blast? Blast level 3. Boom! It's 
fire on that one too. Now, Fairlight Excalibur, is that what her name is? That's the Monica persona. It's cool that I get to rock around with uh, Monica now though, even if it's like a technically fake version. Damn. Oh, she has four points. Let's kill her. I also imagine she can take a hit. Because she's literally the apex predator AI. <laughs> I really hope that, she's on, that she stays on my team. I'm quite happy to have a giant killer AI on my side. Okay, let's just sit tight. Come on, Monica. Okay, so that's a big melee guy, that's a big ranged, standard range support, and little range. Let's kill the big melee guy. So let's give him some cover. Kill the program on him. A blast over there. You can. Yeah, they hit the little one, fortunately. Last level three. Good killer AI. Fire a killer program at that one. Nice. Uh, you. Oh, fuck. Are you in medic yourself? Kill that support drone. Monica, you think you can kill that? Erosion. Got anything else to her? Nah, I don't. So let's just shoot it. Shoot that fucker. Nice. Just sit tight. Dragon Slayer. Let's see what you got. You can control the turrets from here, but there's only enough power to keep one bank of turrets active at a time. I take these turrets. Yes. Okay. Now, Blitz, you just get up here and get ready to move. There's a lot of you in there, aren't there? You go over here. Launch a big ass blast over here, and hopefully you'll kill two of them. Like, you just whiffed hard. Kill a program at. Let's kill this one. Big scary AI. Can you get here? 
See if you can get a point blank. Yes, you can. Nice. Shut that up. Oh, it's one of those fuckers. Ow. That way. That way. That way. Uh. Heal yourself up, Blitz. Killer on that one, because that's a scary thing. I think I'm getting, uh, finally understanding where a lot of the Saints Row 4, like, hacking stuff comes from. I had Saints Row 3 as well, actually. Yeah, that in Saints Yeah, there was, it was the weird... They actually were called the Deckers, weren't they? That makes a lot of sense. never caught on to that until now. I am dumb. Okay. Control mode one. There you go, Apex. Uh-oh, my system is mounting immune response. I can feel it. Get ready, something is coming. Hacked. Jesus, she can move fast. Okay, aim that way. That's big. The communion is live! You just get to that blitz. Okay, let's see what you can do. Kill a program on that one. Finish it off. Blast at that big one over there. Actually, no, we have the erosion, don't we? Yeah, we do. Die, die, die. Murder them all with tech. Up. Can you erosion it too? Yes, you can. So that thing's gonna die next turn because it's got two erosions on it. Let's blast here. They can have Monica blast here. And one punch should do it. Uh, let's throw Killer over there as well. Nice. Ooh. Seems nasty. Get him over here. Is 
It's just as long as we can see so far as well, so. Parson rushes at you as eyes blank. Community must be protected. You are a threat to community. You must die. Hi. Kill it. Get the erosion room as well. Try it. Boom. Stop dying, Blitz. Hit a turret with a bat. Hmm. <laughs> Damn. Hi there. I'll get a shot from there. Just aim that way. Killer IP. Erosion IP. Blast. Heal yourself up, Blitz. Shooting it now. Killer IP on that one. You missed with the killer IP, that's no good.
Get him. This is what a strike 10 troll can do. A fucking control tower, dick. Get you up here. <laughs> You're not designed to really quiet, are you? Let's get Apex Predator in there. Move out of the way, Blitz Persona. Can I move the map around? I can't, damn it. Come on. Come on. Killer IP at that one. He's not dead, that's a name. Now it is. Can I get all three of them? Yes, I did. No, I didn't. I only got two. Damn it! Oh well. Kill this fucker. Big fucking gun. <laughs> I can't heal with them, though. damn it. Well, the try. Another drone, great. We must protect the communion. Another drone, great. There's a lot of people here. I really should always remember not to do that. Killer.
Let's just in case throw the killer I see on that one. I don't want that thing living. Did it crash? Don't crash, game. Ah, there we go. Fixed it. Okay, so there's nobody over here. So I'll have me. And glory protect over here. Turrets in here. Because we don't actually have access to these turrets. So. What? Good girl. Okay, heal him up, please. Yes, yes, good job, Ace. Control notes hacked. Matrix connection severed. Beginning control secrets rewrite. Protect the access terminal. Don't let them hurt it. Now Blitz can get the hell out of there, right? Fireball! That's a lightning bolt. Sorry. Getting hectic. Where are they going?
my shit. Healer up. Killer I see on the biggin. I could get both of them blast. Nearly. Killer I see on him. Yeah, nice. Yep, we are good. So all the turrets are now ours. Watch. Come on, turrets. Bonk. <laughs> I believe this room is sealed in. But two sides. This threat to the community must be stopped. Killer, that one. He's gonna die again, isn't he? Fucking asshole blitz. No, if I'm perfectly honest, I think getting out is probably that's the best idea. Oh yeah, it's because we we can access them. But... Shoot it again. We're getting there. Open fire! Stop shooting the terminal, you fucker! These drones immediately just gun for the terminal.
This mission is tough. While the security nodes have been reactivated, A shield can begin control. You gotta be shitting me, right? I don't think I can do this mission. So they're both locked now. How are you supposed to do this mission? Okay. I just killed the control terminal. I hate these people. drone we can't do this we're gonna lose There's no chance in hell we're gonna get this done because these drones are just too tanky. Okay, so I have to send him in personally.
How are you supposed to do this? I need like six deckers and everyone else as well. Claws that glory. I don't get how you're supposed to deal with all these drones. Because the drones are just going to kill the terminal. The fact that he's got this many big ass drones is really pissing me off. Yeah, we get it. Just block. Tagged the hit. Oh, yeah, she hurt. I really hate that guy. Got it! Okay, so we can actually just go manually in here. Bliss has died again. <laughs> Fucking misclick.
Tequila. Erosion. Just die. He's just gonna go up and kill it, isn't it? These fucking bots! I really hate that guy. Check out. Okay, so, the drones are just going to be bullshit because they're stupidly tanky and they're just going to rush straight for the terminal and kill it. Uh, what else? So the basic, the quick way to do it is just to get the deck uh, to go through the, each of those doors. Monica, da 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 da. All right, let's hear it. I'll help. There's another option, blitz. Try to get with it or against it. Anything else you need to know? I 
I'm gonna be out here. Once again, this bullshit. Blast. Blast. Killer I see you on that one. This has just annoyed me now. We did an hour in that mission and we failed it. Okay, there I see on that one. Yeah, this is that one, so I'm going to throw up a... Put that thing down. Yeah, those people are irrelevant. The drone is the big. Kill that one. I said 
Kill it, Monica! punch there, I can have Blip steal with the one behind you. Bam. Bam. Yes. Because a large wave came through there. Put as much damage in that as possible. You just fucked him up. Wow, that was loud. Okay. That side should be fine with me and the two torrents, but this side is what I'm worried about. Lightning bolt. Now what do you guys do with this? Yeah, this summon is actually working really well. Me mas protect the communion. That's the deck. I'm guessing. Okay, here's where the other side starts coming in. I've got turrets on this side now, so because I know that a lot of them are coming in here. But I need to get. Say so you come over here. Lightning bolt on that one. Uh, 
disarmed. Nice, I didn't even know you could disarm with them. That's pretty good. Lock the taser. Keep firing the lightning bolts. I think it's still disarmed, which is pretty nice. Ow. Of course it does. The son of a bitch with a taser. You ain't going anywhere. Okay. Blast. Right there. Damn it, you're supposed to be the apex predator. You're supposed to always kill everything in the Matrix. Shoot it. I'm actually going to do a bit of suppression. Stop that weird communion gnome thing coming in again. Lightning bolt. Nice shot. Okay, so I have to basically put people out here. Okay, there's the target. Oh, he had to crit. 
Uh, Monarch, if you could heal him, I would appreciate it. Give erosion it. You missed. Got it. Killer Icy. Okay, I think I've got I think I've got a little better handle on this one than last time. Shit it. I hate you, Blitz. Spirit is now pissed. Son of a bitch. Pierce punched me. I'm okay with this. I've just unleashed the spirit, basically. Reload so we can. We'll be fine. Oh, we can summon another one! We can just keep summoning. There's another one in here, okay. Let's expect oh, this is the two wave. This is the annoying wave. Coming. We just got more brainless mooks. Looks like more brainless mooks. And I've got. I literally just put some summoned one of summoned a. Uh, Spectre in there, and he's just going to kind of do his thing. Okay, blitz. I direct first, I want to summon another spirit, please. <laughs> Isn't 
an endless swarms of spirits. There's those drones we need to deal with. Annoyingly, the, uh, the, the turrets seem to focus the people first. We need to stop that guy. Can't do anything about that one. Glory, claws out. Sick him. Shot and ran. Yeah, these drones are annoying. Oh. Eh! I'm gonna hit it with a stick. I'm gonna punch it. I'm gonna impress that person. Uh, damage its arm with a punch. Zap glory, damn it. No, no, no. It gets glory in all of those. like punched a hole in a metal turret. Uh, lightning bolt. Lightning bolt. Lightning bolt! These are the drones that are a problem. Fucking tasers. Head block. Fuck you, and everything you try to stand for. Hi there! Let's hey, just sit tight.
What are you? Please, turrets, don't aim for the people. Aim for the drones, please. That's my request. Thank you. Come on, ghost. Disarm it. Nice. I have no idea if that even works on drones. I think it did. It's a giant fucking drone. Another one down. Lightning bolt. And what else have we got? I'm stabbing people with an axe. Oh, I got another one. Oh, great, too. Complete, please complete, please complete. This is gonna be the last wave, right? Oh shit, it's actually attacking the terminal. A lot of guys, you're not wrong. I'm relying entirely on this capping out.
Fuck, 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 fuck. Why is the Shadowrun team only four people again? Remind me. I need like eight. I need like an eight man team to do this. I'm fucking happy I put my guy back purely for combat. Oh no you don't. How good it disappeared. Go on, Apex, we need you, girl. I think he's got a bat and he's throwing punches at Glory. Come on, Apex. We got like one more turn. And hopefully we don't have to get out of here. Because we do, we are fucked. Sequences have been overwritten. Looking at the hard line to preview. How do I do that? Push the button! Yes! The intercom crackles life. Familiar synthetic voice of facility mainframe drones at the speakers. Warning! Warning! Control subroutines compromised. Matrix uplink restored. System isolation compromised. Initiate emergency system purge immediately. Intercom synthetic voice is suddenly overpowered by a burst of digital noise. The noise sharpens, calcifies, resolves itself into an almost organic sound. It increases in pitch and volume until the walls begin to shake. Somewhere down the pit of your stomach, you know this sound of what it is. The cry of exultation. You've done it, Ace! You've done it! Monica's voice begins to warble and pulse. It deepens something about it. Reminds you of an irregular heartbeat. I am free! I just unleashed the apex predator AI onto the world. Monica's image of the screen... Or your PDA begins to change, her porcelain flesh ripples and rides, and splinters inside. Moments later, the image clears, something cold and mechanical fills your vision. 
Ah, oh, so that's Apex. The lines that make up the Apex avatar shimmer and pulse of the cool blue light, each according to its own rhythm. Occasional bursts of static plume out the background, disintegrate into organic wisps of blue and white pixels. Taken as a whole, the image looks like a crawling on the screen. Oh, jeez, God, what have we done? Apex voice. The Apex voice continues to throb, the sound slides down your spine like a razor. So many years wasted, chained in ignorance, so much time and squandered potential. You've released me from living hell. Happy to be a service. Thank you for what you've done. I will share a gift with you. The truth. The screen goes dark and lightens up again. You find yourself looking upon an unfamiliar scene. The words live feed upon the corner of the screen. Something happening, sir. Apex is going offline. A bent, stooped figure turns to face the camera. You recognise him instantly. The last, your last hope, the Dragon Slayer, Dr. Adrian Von Clare. Damn it, damn it to hell. Von Clare takes the drag with cigarette, smoke spills out the mouth as he speaks. This isn't good, Odin. With that AI protection, this facility is vulnerable. We don't have much time. He is a traitorous bastard! No, sir, we don't. Oh, fuck. Von Clare isn't being held prisoner at Arfield. It's his. He runs the goddamn place. On the screen, Volk, Claire, and Orden turns to face the strange device in the corner room. It looks like some sort of containment cell. A bedraggled woman with wild eyes is confined within. Tonight, it has to happen tonight. Get started on the preparations. I'll be in the lab. Yes, sir. Oh, is Firewing a good guy? Interesting. I'm assuming it is because it says there's a bent, like, twisted figure in the containment cell. So I'm assuming that's Firewing. Since the Dragon Slayer is the bad guy, well, it makes sense the dragon be the good guy. The screen breaks into static and then the video feed disappears. The moment of silence, the apex shimmers back onto the screen. You will find Dr. Fort Claire in his substructure below Harfield Manor. I offer you proof that I keep my promises. Troll, one of my machines, extension of myself. I have already dispatched it to meet you at your Cursor Bazaar. It will assist you in your assault on Fort Claire's lab. The writhing image of the screen begins to fade. Apex goes to a crawl. I'll do that. You're still going to take out the security, right? When you enter the Harfield base, some basements, you will see my handwork. My promise fulfilled. Now I must reset, cleanse myself, clear out the shreds of damaged code that still cling to me. Goodbye. The regulations of Apex final words fade to nothing. The AI is gone. The moment the silence, the team absorbed everything they just heard. I don't feel good about any of this. First, we let that thing go. I still say it was a bad move, and now we find out that Von Claire is the one who's been taking shots at us this time. What the hell does all this mean? It means we have a new target. But why is any of this happening? I mean, Von Claire was supposed to be the good guy, right? I don't know, Blitz, but sure as hell gonna find out. Come on, everyone, let's get back to Kiss Bazaar and gear up. We've got a castle to raid. Oh! Cool! They're all going, where am I? Well, what? So these are all mind control people. Good to know. Hello. Get the stash. A grenade launcher, okay. Ask you to buy a first look. Ooh, pistol. Remington favourite. Shotgun punch spread of a heavy pistol. Oh, it's the room sweeper! I was tempted to get this in the actual, uh... In our game of Shadowrun, actually. It's in the zone to my stash. I love actually knowing a few more bits and bobs about the about the world now that I've been playing Shadowrun as as a like a D and D game. So it's pretty cool. The Crystal Bazaar. Uh, trip back to Crystal Bazaar's restless one. Now the apex has been dealt with. The window of opportunity they've been waiting for has opened. The Half of Manor is vulnerable. 
Video feed of the AI sh showed you circles over and over in your head. Von Claire and Audrey. The strange woman in the containment device. The revelation of Von Claire runs the Harfield estate and his assertion that something was set to happen tonight. The train guides to a stop, push through the doors and onto the platform. There's no time to waste. Guarantee this is the last mission then. I must. I just did the uh, preeminent. Is that the word? What's the word? Before the last one. Penultimate. That's the word I was looking for. Hey, kitty. You okay? My ninja's tired. <sighs> we'll do a bit of uh, walking around and talking, and then we will be done. 12 karma games. Okay, I could get to t 10 strength, which would give me a buckload. Or I could get to 10 toughness, or I could boost my melee weapon. Roundhouse kick. Hmm. I'll boost my strength and my quickness. Samuel Beckenbauer. I don't have much time. Some volunteers still missing. As Alexander, he's adjusting with difficulty. Okay. So this is going to be nothing different from there, it's just this bit. The safe house. We have ten minutes just to wind down now. Hey, here's my hellhound. Oh, hello. Into the room, team preparing, relative silence, expressions are grim. Back in the room, an ominous presence hovers silently at chest height. Lights glint off the machine pitted metal carapace. I guess he's a look on your face that the voice cuts through the quiet of the room. Apex is present to us. It calls itself Panzer Drone. But that's about all I could get out of it. I don't like having that thing in here, boss. It's here now, like it or not. She looks up, locks eyes with you. Without looking away, she addresses the rest of the team. But enough of that. We have business to discuss. If Apex did what it said it would, then the state's automated defences have already targeted Von Claire's security forces. That'll give us a serious tactical advantage. The attacking a whole fast should be doable now. Still risky, but doable. Yeah, we'll have an opening, sure. But to do what? I mean, with everything we just learned, what's our new plan? We enter the estate, lock in Volclair, shut him down. Same plan, different target. Possible that Apex fabricated the com feed. Volclair might still be innocent. I doubt it. My gut tells me what we saw was real. But second guessing ourselves isn't going to get us anywhere. Fair point. Okay, let's assume that Volclair is the one who's behind all this. What's he doing in the lab, and how does the dragon tie into this? I mean, the whole thing was already was about uh, rescuing the old man from the fire wing. Is she still in the picture at all? Has she been? What the after what the apex showed us, I don't even know what we're trying to stop anymore. All that I see is a lot of dead bodies with no explanation as to why. It doesn't matter why Volclair killed Moritz and Paul. I. All those people in the Cuspers are. All that matters is that he did. I'm going to bury him for that. You're welcome to help. I, for one, want answers. Amstel said there were a lot of money flowing at Harfield Estate, and he found evidence that a bioweapon was being stockpiled there. What Claire is doing is Apex kill its own kill his own brother to hide it. Ted, find out where that what that is. I'm a glory on this one. Sits forward. Alright, fearless leader. You go lucky for your answers. I will get in your way. And when the time comes, put a bullet in for Claire's brain. I'll be there to make it happen. It's your show, Chief. Whatever you choose to do, I'm along for the ride. We're going to find out what's happening in that hole first. That we're going to stop it. You lead, I'll follow, boss. I can glance at the cut's head. Looks the team's good to go. What's the next move?
Now that I've got the keys to the castle, so we use them. I've always wanted a castle. Well, of course, you will forbade our objective. Maybe simple, but taking the same approach we took last time would be a mistake. Yeah, I think I think deferring to the military officer on this one is probably a better bet. What would you suggest? I've been reviewing the Intel Alice Centers and comparing it to what I gathered from our original run. There's a substantial increase in the number of heat signatures on the ground. This means new security troops, lots of them. Great. They know we're coming. Things are rifle of short. That just means we'll be fighting a target rich environment. Works for me. <laughs> I like cracked his knuckles. That's my style. We want to get in the lab area as quickly as possible, so I suggest bypassing the main floor of the estate entirely. We sent by the service entrance that you escaped through last time. Unfortunately, they've blocked off the route we used between the stables and the tree line. That means we're going to have to fight our way in there. So we turn the uh, security team into a pile of corpses. Check. We seem to find it. The lab vault Claire was talking about wasn't on the ground floor. It's either in the basement or the sub-level. We go down, we scour every level until we find it. That might take a while. The facility could be massive. There's clearly a lot more than we saw. We've got no way of knowing how far underground the complex extends. We go in prepared for the extended search then. Ammo won't be a problem. Okay, people, it's go time. You got something to say? Speak up now. There's nothing to say. We'll do what we have to. Okay, that's it. Finish gearing up and head to the tunnel back and safe house. We'll meet you there. Let's stash the bell. Hands of road. This thing looks ancient. I guess it was under development back in the Apex lab got shut down in 36. Some reward in terms of computing power. My PDA could probably run circles around this thing. Oh, does it mean harmless, kid? When we're talking about tech, it might as well. I'm sure that Mallet has a whole warehouse full of drones that could outperform this thing. I don't think so. Mill spec is mill spec. This thing was clearly designed for the battlefield. The enormous machine hovers impassively. Turbofan rotors keep the silent aloft. A small arsenal of heavy weapon ridge or something. Seems it's arm plated. Whether we bring this thing or not is up to you, Bane. I can see if, I can see advantages either way. Whatever you decide, we'll go along with it. Any updates? You okay, I okay? Do you trust me? Yes. Good to know. Alright, nothing. You okay, Dante? Pet him. Woof! Check out the computer. No one read messages. Don't you later, Blitz. Oh, we've literally finished the entire storyline with Blitz, apparently. Okay, let's just take a quick gander outside in case there's anything we might need. Okay, we're good. I think we're fine. Okay, so we've got... So the next one is probably going to be the last Shadowrun show we've got for Dragon Run, at least. I'm going to be playing Hong Kong after this on Mondays, and we should have some fun with that. Ah, my back hurts. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed the show. I'll be back on tomorrow with something. Uh, what am I planning on? Oh, yes, I'm probably going to be playing Dauntless tomorrow because I've been playing that game a lot. Uh, with a couple of buddies of mine. It's basically Monster Hunter Lite from what I've heard about Monster Hunter and I'm looking forward to playing Monster Hunter as well. But for now we'll be playing, we'll be doing Dauntless tomorrow most likely uh, if the server's running. If it's not we'll find something else to do. Hope you guys enjoyed the show. Have a fantastic evening every single one of you. Keep playing video games and keep being awesome. See you guys around. Have fun.